Imagine a nightclub full of celebrities drinking, doing drugs, and having sex every single night. Well, it existed, and it was called Studio 54. But why did it end so badly? From fashion designers like Holston and Calvin Klein to megastars like Michael Jackson, Freddie Mercury, Donald Trump, Cher, and many, many more. Studio 54 was a nightclub in Midtown Manhattan, New York, and it opened in 1977 after a $400,000 transformation from an abandoned theater by entrepreneurs Steve Rubell and Ian Schruger turning it into one of the most exclusive clubs in the world. Hundreds of people lined up every single night in hopes to get in, often unsuccessful. Steve Rubell would sometimes handpick people from the door, rejecting most, including those who didn't sound or look cool enough. People attempted many things to try and catch the eye of the bouncers, with one individual even turning up outside on a horse. The nightclub was a huge success, even too successful. It ended up getting raided by the feds. The two owners ended up getting arrested for tax evasion, and the club was shut down.